What's going on party people? This is Sage Starkey, your entertainment producer with Imprint Crew. I am here, uh, not for a location, not for entertainment, but for uh, an activity. So y'all ready to check out a hidden gem? Ladies and gentlemen, let's go. Hidden gems, yeah! Oh snap, I found one. This is called the Liquid Denver Tour by Urban Adventures Denver where a tour guide spends four hours with you and shows you the best of the best breweries and distilleries that Denver has to offer. It's perfect for team building, corporate retreat activities, or just a fun night out on the town. Now first we were greeted by our tour guide, JC. Now JC had a baby two days ago and he took the time to come out and give us this exclusive tour, so thanks JC. Anyway, we were greeted by JC at Union Station and STOP! <laughs> Sorry, other me. I'm gonna do things a little differently. I wanna save the best for last. And my favorite place was actually the first place. So, I'm gonna take you on a trip to the future. <laughs> Boom, our final destination was a cider bar called Stem Ciders, where they have any cider you can think of from salted cucumber cider to coffee cider. And we walked in on trivia night. Before that, we went to the preservery, where we were treated to one of the best meals I've probably ever eaten. Made by the one and only Chef Cooper! We each ordered one entree, but because he could see that we loved the food so much, he brought us each an additional entree just so we could try the food. When I create my menu, I want to make sure everyone is included. I know what it's like to feel left out, so if you're a vegan, we have something on here for you. And if you're broke, we have $4 tacos for you too. Before that, we went to a great brewery in Rhino. Did you see my last video? <laughs> Plug. It's called Epic Brewery. Obviously, they make their own beer in-house, but my favorite part is that they've turned their beer canisters into the lighting fixtures and the decor. P.S. Try the popcorn. It's so good. And finally, last but was first, but it's not least, which is why it's last, but was actually first. Block Distilling Company. They are a brand new distillery that opened in December, which means a few things. They can only sell white liquors because it takes about two to three years to age anything dark. But don't worry, they have a timer counting down until they can open their whiskey and have a huge whiskey celebration, <laughs> which I was invited to, or I invited myself. It doesn't matter. One final thing before we leave, here's an exclusive interview with JC, the awesome tour guide and the owner of Urban Adventures Denver. <laughs> what? What? <laughs> Take it away, other me. I am here with JC from Urban Adventures De uh, at Denver. Denver, yes, we're in Denver right now. And so I'm gonna ask him just a quick question. Thank you for your time. He's been an awesome tour guide. Uh, tell us, um, what is your favorite part about um, giving these tours and having uh, and, and, uh, and showing people around this beautiful city? Well, my favorite part, I would say, is definitely trying to bring, bring people, bring tours who haven't been here before and uh, bring them over here and meet like uh, business owners and people who are actually doing it and and who are super collaborative with everybody else around town because that's exactly what Denver is. We're super collaborative. We, uh, we enjoy helping everybody out, lifting everybody up. And so helping people come and see that and experience that, I feel like you really get a sense of what Denver's about. That's, that's my favorite part. That's awesome. Well, and if, if you're in Denver doing urban adventures, ask for JC because he's literally the best. <laughs> so, <laughs> alright, this is Sage Starkey with Imprint Group and Urban Adventures. We'll see you real soon. Until then, leave, leave your, your mark. mark. Yeah, peace out. <laughs> Hidden gems, yeah. Y'all see me travel through time. <laughs> yeah, that was cool.